hello everyone so this is the second episode that we are working on this creating this uh, t-rex character from scratch that means from the modeling part to applying material parts and rigging and added animations and then finally implementing it as a playable or npc ai controlled character inside unreal so today we are going to work on uh, how to define material slots and how to apply materials different materials for different components of this character so we worked on the basic modeling part yesterday but you might see there are some differences in the place that we stopped and in this model because i have done some changes uh, offline just like moving a little bit of vertices and adjusting to make it look like until i am satisfied so you can do the same as well in fact i suggest you to do that same as well if you're following along so yeah now we are going to see how to apply materials so we are not going to do any kind of a texture painting we are just simply define some colors for the body and a different color for the mouth and eyes so just like that we are going to keep it simple so right to add materials we need to go to the shading mode please note that we are still in the edit mode so go back to object mode so we can select individual objects and i'm going to select this main dinosaur body and under slot here in this when you go to the shading layout this is what you get press new and i'm gonna rename it m body and base color i'm gonna give some dark green look you can give any color you prefer and here but these settings we do will not affect inside unreal it's just we you know, in unreal we have to separately set the materials this is just to see how we need to set the materials here but for now i'll just uh increase the roughness we can reduce the specular because this shouldn't look shiny i don't want it to look shiny actually okay now we have a single color everywhere the body in the body so now let's say i want to add some different color for the eye so select the mesh and press tab or you can switch to the edit mode here and select face selection mode and i'll select these four faces that's going to be the white area of the eye so here under slot i'll add a new one and assign it now create a new material m i and i think i'm gonna keep it white it's already white so no need to change it perhaps reduce the roughness but you we don't really see now it already look like a face but we need to make the middle part um black select the middle part we are still in the face selection mode click on slot add and assign now press new m iris that's what we call the middle part right and the base color i'm gonna make it black okay so use you, you don't see it exactly as black because we have some lighting set up here you can see this. so that reflections are also happening maybe if i reduce the specular yeah it looks completely black now okay now let's give a different color to this tip of the leg and this tip of the hand so let's say like uh, nails so another trick you can select this face and press ctrl plus to expand that selection so we can select all the faces around that area 
and here uh, slot plus assign new let's name it m else and nil so also could be black or if the dinosaur is wearing some cutex something you can apply a different color <coughs> so since this is like a cartoonish dinosaur i will make it i can make it red but let's just make it black for now and select the this face also press ctrl plus in the numpad and here also i want to assign m nails okay uh, this is not how the t-rex hands are they are they have like nails and everything this looks more like a hoof but i'm okay with this look or this design i want to keep it simple okay now for the inside of the mouth i want to have like a pink color as in here because it should look like the inside of a mouth but i don't want to make this whole surface pink i still need to have some edge here just like in our reference so what i can do is we are still in the edit mode if i go back to modeling i don't think it's necessary to go into modeling actually we can do it here go to edit mode press k so we can select the knife tool uh yeah click here 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 I need to see the other areas here, here, here. Okay, I think that should be enough. Enough. Press enter, and maybe we need to make this area a bit pointy. So go to edge selection mode, press GG, and move it along. Slide it along. Mm -hmm. GG. Okay, now it's round and nice. Uh, yeah. Now go back to face selection mode again and select these faces. Then here add another material. Assign. Let's add the material M mouth base color i'll assign something like this now it looks like a mouth okay so that's how you add materials uh, um, if i go back to object mode and if I share this mode, this is our model now. This is how it looks now. Pretty cool for me. As an amateur modeling, amateur 3D artist, this is good enough for me. Okay. So yeah, and I'm still not going to import this into Unreal because we still need to rig this character and create some animations also otherwise we just we can just import this into unreal like as a static mesh and see how it looks but i don't want to do that now so yeah i'll see let's look into the rigging part in the next episode so thanks for watching as always all the project files and everything that i have done so far you can access in my patreon page 
and link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club see you in another episode goodbye